Hi everyone, how's it going out there? Welcome to Red Scouser 7799 channel. Today I've got a brand new product for us to review. This is the new Panini AXL 2018 collection. I'm sure you guys out there are very familiar with this product. This is the third season that Panini has released such product. I'm sure you guys remember last year that was last year's product. What you see here is a Hungarian starter pack. And of course, Panini are releasing this before the start of the season. So we will find a lot of players in their old kits, which is a shame because you want to collect a new binder with players in their new teams. But I guess Panini want to compete with tops and the Champions League, so they're releasing this earlier. This is the UK starter pack, £5.99. Uh, the reg the um, retail price, you get two packets of 18 cards as usual and one limited edition. You get the guide, the binder and the game board. So it's your standard basically from the UK release. Each country has its own configurations. All right, so here we go. And one difference this year with the UK packaging is it's not visible. If you remember previous years, you used to be able to see the limited edition card. Not this year, they've made it like the other collections. So here we go. On the cover, of course, Ronaldo Lewandowski we get Ali, Messi, Pogba, Buffon and Suarez, all the big guns, the regular playmat. I'm not going to spend too much time on that. And the binder back here. And see the first page. There's nothing here, just there. Uh, yeah, in the back we will get the official guide. Now, if you guys don't mind, I'm just going to pick up the iPod. going to go a bit higher so we can cover it off top up top because one of the legs of the tripod are broken so I want to give you a full view so here we go here's all the teams that are included or oh, sorry the pages of what's in the collection here we go how to play the game the rules teammates there will be 200 cards there will be 16 rising stars 48 international stars, 22 team logos that are going to represent the 22 teams, 58 fans favourite, that's a lot, that's more than last year, 25 impact signings, less than last year, 27 milestones, that's a new one, I like to see that, goal stoppers, 9 cards as usual for the keepers, 9 defensive rocks as usual, 9 key players that hasn't changed. Game changes, we get 9. I think we got more than that last year. I think we got about 15. Then we have 3 defensive walls. So that's a new one. They took some from the game changes. Put 3 defensive walls. Not bad. Here's on the virtual how you play online. 3 midfield engines and the 3 attacking trios. I think those are going to be like sort of the acetate cards. Like sort of the see-through ones we had last year. And then we get nine club and country. Top masters, there will be six of them. Interesting. Two AXL legends, one invincible. Invincible card is usually done in the Serie A collection and also in the Spanish La Liga. So they've taken that and added it to FIFA. Now here, something else they've added. Uh... Each team is divvied up in terms of how many cards they've got in the collection. So, Boca Juniors, you get the club badge, four fans favourite and one milestone. And, of course, you get the teammates and so on and so forth for each team. As you can see, United have got 12 special cards in addition to the base. Barcelona, 15. 11, Atletico Madrid, 13, Real Madrid. So... Very, very nice guide. These 
if you collect the Spanish and Italian leagues binders they do that for them so there Panini have added that for the FIFA 365 fantastic here's the four international teams Argentina Cameroon England and Germany last year there was a bit more there was Belgium there was Chile Colombia this year it's less another thing here is they're telling you where the limited editions are going to be so if you see in the starter pack in the UK Pogba, PK, Cruz and Navas one of them at random is going to come out premium packets you're going to get seven premium gold you get two the multi packs you get three standard tins there's going to be nine and they're going to be all different and then in the pocket tins you're going to have two four six eight ten and strike it magazine will have one every issue from number 78 to 83 I will be reviewing that as well the strike it magazine here what are you going to get in the British market soon tin box premium packet premium gold and of course the pocket tins I don't know why they have not put a picture of that but here's the checklist all the teams as you can see they're all covered and basically the teams Boca Juniors, Palmeiras, Atletico Nacional so there's a few new teams United, Atletico Madrid, Barca, Real Madrid, PSG we get Bayern Munich, Borussia Dortmund, Ferenc Varos again Juve with the new badge, Roma, Club America we get Feyenoord this year from Holland, Legia Warsaw, Benfica Spartak Moscow is a new one and of course Cameroon is a new one and here all divvied up power up cards multiple and here we go so this was the guide so we've looked up the guide and it's basically different languages different markets we get two packets let's look at the design two different designs one with Ronaldo de la Ale Griezmann and one with Messi, Suarez, Pogba, Lewandowski and Dzeko so let's have a look at the cards and see what we're gonna get all right first up is the international star Joshua Kimmich so the border is like a field in the back like last year up top team card number player is a cross help yourselves out for that code so this is the international star now we get the base Serdar Tasci for Spartak Moscow red border as well skyline in the back not bad nice one then we get Kevin Gamiero for Atletico Madrid just to compare it with last year so this is last year's base card this is this year's base card as you can see it's still the attributes are up top the team badge moved top left corner instead of down the middle which is much better it gives the card or the player uh, a better photograph overall then the name down here is changed to team across and of course this is the card number and it's down here and in the back it's basically different as well this is the same here the field the codes are down there so different as you can see here the team colors are the same here they've changed it a bit with the design so not bad not bad at all from Panini Here's Lukas Boll for Ferenc Varos, Zobnin, Spartak Moscow, Vermeer, Kenneth Vermeer, the goalkeeper for Feyenoord, a new team this year. We get Diego Perotti for Roma, and nice one. Here's our first insert, subset, multiple club and country, Alba and Busquets. I like those cards, and as you can see here, 
they have added sort of a design with the team colors in the back and also here the Barca colors the blue and sort of the, the purplish and down here not bad at all and then we get a impact signing Feyenoord Jean-Paul Boitius all right again nice shine to the cards a different design than last year with a profile picture for the player not bad at all okay second packet Guillermo Sara keeper for Boca Juniors Bruno Perez Roma Denis Suarez Barcelona look at that the team colors coordinate with the team kit really nice shame it's the old Barcelona kit not the new one that's what happens when you release too early Brad Jones at Feyenoord he used to play for us in Liverpool the last few years then he left last season he's with Feyenoord won the league with them last year Andreas Samaras for Benfica here is Edison Alvarez a rising star for Club America here's Edin Dzeko and yes nice one Fire. it's a fans card Feyenoord milestone 15 times Dutch champions fantastic Dirk Kout ex Liverpool player now retired legend nice card nice effect if you see in the back really well made and yeah we got Ferenc Faros club badge fantastic I like the club badges it's my favorite of all subsets I like collecting them there we go, nice one. Let's have a quick look at the odds before we look at the limited edition. These are the UK, UK odds. 459 cards, including 264 base, 132 fans, 1 in 1, 36 power up, 1 in 4, 18 multiples, 1 in 5, and 9 rare cards, 1 in 20. So we've pulled a multiple already in this one. We've pulled a fans. We've pulled another fans and we've pulled three. So we pulled three fans cards. Those are one in one. So these are the most basically available ones. So that's the two packets. Let's have a look, see what limited edition we pulled. Boom! Tony Cruz. Beautiful. That's a nice card. As you can see, the difference this year, they're back to vertical cards, comparing it to a horizontal back then last year it was horizontal there you go and as you can see the difference limited edition is behind the player attributes you get the badge really lovely lovely cards this year I like them I like them vertical they just fit nicer in the binder Beautiful effects on the card. And this is last year's. Not really fond of them. I hope they never do horizontals again. I like verticals. But yeah, here we go. So that was it, guys. This was the opening of the new FIFA 365 collection. That's released, of course, by Panini. This is the UK starter pack. We got two packets and the Tony Cruz limited edition. I hope you guys have enjoyed this video. Don't forget to subscribe and like. Until then, take care. Cheers.